Hey, what's up, beautiful people? Today is May 30th, and here's your daily energy report. So, can you feel it? I'm sure you can, all right? All this crazy shit going on in the world, all these riots, all these people going just fucking batshit crazy, all right? Things are, <laughs> if you think this is like as bad as it's gonna get, you are dead wrong, okay? This is where all the stuff that has been bubbling up or stuffed underneath the surface from all this pandemic experience is starting to come up. This is the real stuff that's being exposed that has really been shut down. Now, guys, with Neptune at 20 degrees and Mars approaching Neptune in this mutable energy, okay, Neptune is all about the media, right? Or, I'm sorry, Pisces is all about the media. And Neptune being in there is like delusion, illusion. With Mars coming in there, okay, this is going one of two ways, all right? And right now, Mars is square to the sun, all right? And in this mutable energy, it's very, and expect the unexpected. It's like, we don't know what the fuck's going to happen, okay? But people are losing their shit. Mental, uh, emotional, and like mental stability, we're going to start to see the people that really do, are a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs right now. And we're going to see the people that really have their shit together, Okay. Right now, there's going to be stories coming out. There's going to be, you're going to be seeing people, that, a lot of the stuff is being staged, okay? This is like the media, like, acting and playing and, like, and creating a, a scene, creating a movie, all right? In order to get the mass amount of people, okay, the masses, is a south node in, in Sagittarius, getting the masses to see a certain thing, okay? But this is a distraction. This is a deflection so that it can take our focus away from creating the reality that we want, the North Node in Gemini, okay? Creating um, a community, creating a soul tribe, creating an environment where you feel safe and secure and strong and, and, and you trust, you trust people. So really that's what we want to do right now. Like our default should be to staying with the communication, the people that we know and trust and love. Staying around people that make us feel safe and make us feel secure. If you're not in that situation, you need to take a step back and observe your life and find out why. And chances are, if you're not in that situation too, you are glued to the fucking screen and looking at all this shit that's going on in the world. Guys, we need to pull away from that energy. And that's going to make it really, really obvious when we have this, this lunar eclipse on June 5th. So I just got done making the, the June monthly, um, monthly energy report. And I go way deep. It was a really long video. I go way deep into the energies. Guys, this is such a critical and important time to step into your reality. Now, when I say reality, it means what's in front of your face. Focus on what is in your face, not what's on the media, not what's on your computer, not what's on your phone, not what's at work. What is right in front of you? What's right here, right now? What is going on? As you're walking down the street or sitting in your house or eating your food, okay, are you in a house? Are your children healthy? Is your wife or your husband good? Are you, or if you're single, is everything okay? If it is, awesome. Stay focused on that. If it's not, create that. Get rid. It's time to gut. It's time to drain the swamp in our own life. The same thing that's going on at the political level it's the same thing that's going on within it, within us. We have to drain the swamp of these shadows, of these things that do not deserve to be in our life. We have been selling ourselves short for our entire lives, okay? And we're being made aware of that right now. And this energy, this, this Mars energy is going to get stronger and stronger throughout the year. Next month, it's going to go into Aries and it's going to stay there for the rest of the year. That's going to be no fucking joke. Okay, that you want to talk about passion and, and activity and intensity and getting out there and making shit happen, positive and negative ways. Mm -hmm. Okay, but right now we still have to come up to this Mars and uh, Neptune conjunction. Okay, which is which can be the spiritual warrior. So you either can be delusion, it can be a delusion, <laughs> and it can be confusing. It can be like, what the fuck is going on? when you're not in touch with your own reality, or it can be, I am centered and I have a deeper sense of purpose now than ever before in my life. And that is what you want to focus on. That is where we need to go. Our spiritual 
purpose for this life is being exposed. And if you don't know what your purpose in this life, get a reading from me. I will tell you. Everyone has a purpose in this life. Okay? The problem is a lot of people, they just lie to themselves and they suppress their own authenticity and they don't understand or know what they're supposed to do because they don't know who the fuck they are. Okay? And that's okay. Everybody has to go through a process, but right now we are in this crucible, if you will. We're in this process with, where the universe said, hey, it is time to look at yourself. It is time to wake up. It is time to see. It is time to face the things that you have been refusing to face for your entire life. Not just your entire life, but for generations. This is facing karmic shit from past lives, from generation upon generation, three, four, five generations down, down the line, okay? This is clearing a ton of karmic lineage stuff. So get ready, guys. This shit's going to get crazy. We're in a sort of a process of purification right now, and we're coming into it, okay? We're not at the end of it. We're just at the tip going into it. So as this purification process happens, you, we really need to be aware of where we're going and what we're stepping into because this is going to dictate what is going to happen for the rest of our lives, how the rest of our life is going to look. Do you, are, do you want to create the life, the reality that you really want, or are you just going to be like, I'll do it tomorrow? Because you don't want to feel it. You don't want to face it. That's you. You need to listen to this and you need to take action. You need to step up. And you need to stay in your power. Bottom line. Okay, so thank you for checking this out. Um, I will be posting my uh, monthly video here shortly. Please check it out and please like, share, and subscribe. We have to get this message out to as many people as possible. I appreciate I appreciate you guys so very much for tuning in. Um, if you'd like a reading from me, please go to my website. You can also get my free ebook, uh, 25 Steps to Navigating the Ascension Process, and um, uh, join my Opportunity Community because that's fucking bomb.com. Yeah, baby. I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.